Good afternoon, guys. It's uh, Thursday, about 4 o'clock. Uh, about 57 degrees, almost no humidity. I want to do a quick mail call video and uh, just throw something up for you guys to watch. Um, first of all, I want to say uh, thank you to Andrea. I got my Girl Scout cookies in the mail. We will be enjoying them this weekend. Um, haven't got the paint that I ordered yet, but I imagine you're probably going to mix that up and I'll probably get that sometime soon, but I'm in no hurry, so don't don't even worry about that. So, first of all, I want to say thank you to Matt, Chevaholics Garage, making stuff from nothing. That <laughs> that is that is a good slogan, buddy. I think we've all had to do that once or twice. And I'm sure many of you can guess who this is from. All right, got a letter there. John, Joe Chance, thank you, sir. Looks awesome. I have not forgotten about you. Um, actually, uh, let's see. I'll look that up. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'll look that up in a second. But um, I uh, got a couple goodies that I've gotten off eBay here the past couple of days. Now, where did I put the one thing? Oh, right here. I seem to enjoy using my uh, iPhone a little bit more. It's a little bit easier to upload the videos so I'm gonna try to work with this for now um, but this cool little stand I mean it's on about 10 inches tall I, uh, your iPhone or actually any phone will clip in there the legs are telescopic which I can't do it with one hand man I don't know how you guys do this stuff yeah so that's pretty cool and then the top part can uh, actually unscrew and I can put this on my regular stand which is was my original intention anyway but it might come in handy with that when I'm uh, working here on the lift close to the bench and then I also got really cool deal I'm sure a lot of you guys know what this is but uh, I know how expensive it is got a Hutchins Bondo Buster if you look at it it looks like the pad has barely if ever been used I mean there's no wear on it at all. And uh, you guys know how expensive these things are. I got this thing for 120 bucks shipped to my door. I couldn't believe it. But now it's probably worth about 80. And uh, this weekend, I know on one of my last videos, I told you guys about my Mustang, my Cobra. Um, there she is. You can see she's on the left, so you know that there's something going to be done to her, or needs to be done to her. But um, I'll save that for another video. That gives me a reason to talk on another video. But um, I'll be working on this this weekend. I got things that I wanted to do before and then other things that I have to do. So uh, I'll leave it at that. Um, uh, let's see. I have... This that I have to send out, I haven't forgot about you, buddy. Um, I forgot Harley, something garage or something along those lines. I haven't forgotten about you. I will uh, get that out here in the next couple of days as soon as I get a chance to box it up. So that'll go out. And then, I don't know if I'm going to be able to see it from here. John, Jeb Chance. I have this. water separator um, I know you had PM me and said you needed uh, a separator that um but you didn't need an oiler well I have this one I'm not using it it's on my other compressor that I haven't put in service yet um, but you're more than welcome to it looks like it's got quarter inch inlet and outlet um, I believe that this one has never been used either, 
I put it on there and uh, it may have been used, it may not have been used, but it, if you look at it, there's, there's no markings on it other than where I marked the inlet and outlet. So if you're interested in that one, that's the one that uh, I was telling you about. So if you want that, you're more than welcome to it. I'll put that in the box and send it to you. And uh, with that, I think that's about it.